guys today I'm going to show you if you have hacked your PSP and it is not showing the games which are in ISO format you can see that this PSP is actually hacked and it is not showing the ISO files which I have copied on the memory stick uh, what you have to do is go to system settings uh, and uh, format your memory stick first of all okay format is completed now go to restore default settings press x okay yes restore is completed now press X button to restart it takes some time it's now restarting and now you have to do the settings now it's over you are back to your PSP now I have to connect your PSP to your PC and follow the steps hey guys I am back now I am going to connect my PSP to my PC it's done now I have provided a link in the description from where you can download the necessary files you will be needing for this step it has a folder named PSP open it and open the game folder now copy the three folders named C CIPL flasher fast recovery pro update copy these three folders into the I'm sorry into the PSP folder and then game folder of your PSP now I have copied this now you can copy the ISO files or games to your ISO folder of your PSP right there and uh, I have some ISO games as well uh, this is a Dragon Ball Z I'm going to copy it the ISO file to the ISO folder of the PSP it takes a while 13% thirty percent it's actually beneficial if you purchase original games but now actually we're talking about the pirated games for PSP now it's done now I'm disconnecting the PSP from my PC and you can follow the steps after that now I have disconnected the PSP from my PC now you, you can go to the memory stick option now it is showing my Dragon Ball Z Shin Budokai. if still your PSP is not showing the game you can go to the memory stick again and run the fast recovery option it will reboot your PSP and you will be with your game thanks for watching please comment and subscribe